Coach, just uh, had a couple weeks of cam now. Just your general overall thoughts about your group. <laughs> I'm excited. Um, they've done well. I think the most important part to me was the young guys, their growth and seeing how they do. And they've done really well. Um, I had some surprises, so that's always good. The older guys, they've taken care of business for the most part. What, what's um, it been with D-Cam? Because we've seen, we saw that in the spring, and he's carried that momentum into camp. Yeah. Um, he, progression? Progression, yeah. He just keeps getting better every day. He's that kid. He just works at it. He wants to be great and takes it one day at a time. And every day he, he gets better at something, which is amazing. So, because he's he's pretty darn good right now. So, because of, of his minor injuries in the spring, we we didn't get to see Marcus Bain mm -hmm. much. And now that we get to see him, he, he can be special too. What what have you seen from him so far? Yeah, he's uh, the thing I love about him most is his demeanor, the way he goes about his work. But football wise, he's sharp, right? He he picks up on things really quickly. You only got to tell him once. Really good ball skills, tough tackler. Um, just really good football instincts for that position. So I'm excited about it. How has Forbes' progression look? Been great, man. He really has had – this is his best camp, in my opinion, um, not only as a football player but as a leader for this team. He's done a good job of leading the young guys. Uh, but also just just honing in on his techniques and being more consistent you know, every play. We know he's going to make some big plays, but every play he's been a little bit more consistent. It seems like every practice there's an NFL scout pulling you aside after practice to talk about a player. Obviously, that's a pretty good development, but what does that say maybe about the development of your group that's happening so regularly? Yeah, um, no, it, it honestly, I, I know the kids see it and they get excited by it, and I think for them it's good to see because they, hard work pays off. And what, we, what we're doing and how we do it uh, translates uh, for them to, to that next level because I think most, most of them is their ultimate goal. But they just don't know the scouts are asking me, do I have a, do I, do I have any interest in playing anymore? And I just, I turn it down. So. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm sure that uh, Martin Emerson getting off to a good start with the Browns probably helps your job as far as motivating your guys. Yeah, yeah, man. They 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 kept sending in the group text and they fired up about it. And more importantly, like the technique that he was using and stuff like that, the things that we do. Um, and they just they just got fired up about it and. I think them seeing him do it and them seeing him out here last year uh, gives them a little bit more motivation. Um, and it really makes it that much closer for them. We hear coaches say all the time that competition brings out the best in every room. Would you kind of say that's the case with Ferge? Because he had a, kind of gets lost in the shuffle, but he had a solid spring. He's having a good camp. And is that competition bringing the best out? You bet. Um, think about it. Between Junior, DeCam, uh, Banks and Furge, I mean, they're all pushing each other every day. And every day it's hard. We do corner of the day every day, and it's hard for me to pick because all of them do something really good at some point throughout the day, and they're really consistent. So, I mean, it's really it's really heightened their focus, um, but also they're pushing each other to be better every day. So that's really good. Seems like the guys in your group, especially Marcus, aren't afraid to, to chirp a little bit, get into a little bit, I guess. Uh, how excited does maybe that competitiveness make you, you know, early part of, of the you know practices so far? Uh, yeah, you can't be in my room if you ain't got a chip in the show. You can't be in my room if you have any swagger. Right? I tell them, go out, go make some plays, talk a little smack, let's have some fun, right? That's what this is about. What about Hunter Washington? Obviously, he got here in June. What have you seen? It seems like he's gotten better each week. He's taken off. Um, his last four practices have been his best practices. He's really, he's trending upwards right now. Um, Coach Ronette just said something about him to the whole group. I mean, the kid, he's taking it all in. He had a really good summer. Um, First few practices, learning everything. Now he's now he's hitting his, hitting the ground running. He's, he's getting his feet under. He's understanding everything. And now we get to see how athletic he is, how his instincts, and how good a football player he is. Obviously, he's got a lot of guys ahead of him, and his time will come. But we didn't even see Nal Davian make plays out here. Yeah, yeah. Um, I was Saturday was really good for the young guys. Um, Will Hardrick, Davian Collins, man, they made you know, interception after interception, PBU after PBU, and that's exciting um, because. The things that are from going from practice are going into a scrimmage, and now the next phase is obviously a game. But they they have the confidence that they can do it. Coach Arnett was saying that you know he's kind of noticed that DeCarlos is is taking a lot from what he's seen you know Emmanuel do, and I guess is that kind of an example of, of when you guys talk about Emmanuel being a, a leader by example. Is that kind of the, the type type of stuff you're looking for? Oh yeah. So I most of the time I don't have to coach much because they're correcting each other. You know Emmanuel's getting them right. Uh, Decam Banks they're all getting them right. So. Uh, 
and it's sometimes it's good for them to hear from the players and not hear my voice all the time. And the Carlos, man, he's 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 grown by leaps and bounds just this fall camp. Uh, I'm excited about what he has. To bring.